What's up everybody, welcome back to Creating Creations. So around four months ago I made a video on how to make Magnus Effect Cup Gliders and that video has performed very well so far receiving over 170,000 views. So today I thought that I would be answering a few of your questions on that video. So without any further ado, let's get this video started. To start this off, we have Kevin Boxrucker's comment wondering if this would work using Styrofoam Cups and I'm pretty sure it would, but let's give it a test. So I finished making it, now let's give it a test. This is just like a rubber band, large rubber band. Just wrap it around it. Tight, but it doesn't have to be too tight. So it's about like that. Then just launch it off. The only main difference with the styrofoam cup Magnus Fit cup glider is that it's a lot lighter so it doesn't go forwards as much as the plastic cuff one. But let's get on to the next comment. Okay, so the foam cup Magnus Fit cup gliders work pretty good. So now let's move on to the next question. So the Brad1026 was wondering what would happen if you added a slight amount of balance weight to give a little more rotating inertia. So let's give it a try. Okay, so for counterbalance, I just added a little bit of duct tape to both sides to kind of add some extra weight to both ends of the glider. So now let's give it a test. Test two. Okay, so I can't really tell that they're performing much different than each other. If anything, I think the one with counterbalance is performing a bit worse than the one without. So let's do side by side shot of the one with and the one without counterbalance. Yeah, so I'm pretty sure now that the one of counterbalance does not work nearly as good as the one without counterbalance, and I'm pretty sure the reason is because the counterbalance, if you don't get it exactly right, it makes it wobble, like you probably saw in that footage. The one of the counterbalance was wobbling in its flight, which hinders its aerodynamics. So, er this is the end of the video. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, please smash the like button and subscribe to my channel if you're first time visiting. See you in the next one.